Thank and you then so much. you also have your own place. Um, should we tell the story? Should we tell the story? What I do you guys think? I'm gonna do you want to hear the story? story? Do you want to hear the story? I'm gonna tell the story. I would like to tell the story first. Charlotte and I have been dear friends for ten years now, and midway through quarantine, so I moved to New York when I was seventeen because I was modeling and by yourself. Um, family still here. Family still here. Um, and you know I have family out there, but yeah, I moved to New York when I was seventeen, so I moved out. And I've been living there the past few years, and I come back here a lot to visit my family. But during the panty, during the Patricia, <laughs> I came home and I ended up staying with my family. And I was like, it's weird to move back in with your parents when you've been out for two years. When you're out for two years, you're in New York. Is it a place that you own? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Your place. Rent it. Yeah. So you don't own it. I rent it from my parents. Oh, you have a family place. Got it. Makes sense. Um, no, I also, by her, the way, during the, with during the pandemic, I was like, I love you guys so much. I can't pay rent anymore. <laughs> um, but so yes. during the pandemic, you come back to LA. I come back to LA. I moved back in with my parents, which was kind of just like, whoa, hello. Uh, it was really nice though. But after a few months when I was like, you know what? I think I'm actually just going to base out of LA anyways. Um, and Charlotte was feeling like moving out of her parents' house. We decided to move in together. Oh, you guys live together? For a week or two? The same time that we move in together, I went through a breakup and she got a new boyfriend. So it was like... It was awful timing. and um, Horrible fucking timing for both of us. And so... Like literally same... Honestly, like same day. The house day. that Charlotte lives in now, I, I lived in with her for two weeks, three weeks. Right, I'm confused. Yeah. You moved in or you're, so you're no, not we, living we, together? No, we lived together. We lived at past tense together. We lived together. together. I was then, like, you know what? I want to be friends with you forever. We can't live together. Whose place is it? Now I live there. Now it's hers. I'm just renting it though. Uh, and your boyfriend, and I apologize for not doing my research well enough, but he's he's uh, an actor, mm -hmm. strong dude. Very strong, yeah. Uh, hot guy. Yeah, I would say. And you guys have been together for since September. Yes, August. Is there a lot of like... It goes on with that? I mean... No, I think it's it's all just like I try to stay super private. We don't do anything either. Like it's a it's pandemic. A it's the Patricia, you mm -hmm. know. Mm -hmm. So um, it's kind of nice to have like we, everyone stays home anyways. So just stay home. Do you is there a difference between dating as a famous person uh, versus uh, not being famous, but being in high school and dating? I never dated anyone until I was out of high school. So I have no idea what it it's like to date someone in high school well i look at charlotte because i know charlotte knows what it's well like i don't get pa i don't get paparazzi i'm not like that level but I, I i don't know i've been dating since i've been young i think i don't know i always though dated i never dated like high schoolers i i Hell always yeah, you're so fucking cool <laughs> charlotte I always never dated, dated you're people, like Cher in charlotte never dated people her own age no i always dated um i always dated older guys so I kind of always it was now that you're Bill. can I ask a question? Dad. My dad knows. Now that you're older, looking back, like now that you're the age of the guys that you dated when you were in high school. Oh, I thought you were talking. How does it? How does it make you feel? I don't know. It's a weird. It's a weird um, conundrum, you might say, because sometimes I think like I was. I was the you know the girl in high school that was never at school because I was always working and you know the people that I worked with and the people that I surrounded myself with for my job and for pleasure because you know I was like so obsessed with music I still am so it's like everything that I would do in my job like those were my people those were my best friends those were my um you know the dudes that I would meet so it's just kind of like the people that I was surrounded by were the people that I was dating and I was older in the sense of like I you know was working and making money and I wasn't into you know i never went to high school parties or i've never done a keg or like i've never i've never experienced never done a keg? Like that never i've never either what is doing a keg i don't know isn't it like the well, big sure. barrel neither of us <laughs> the big drink. barrel when you go neither do it i only see it we're not oh, drink drink we don't drink i don't drink i don't drink i don't drink should we have a little champagne <laughs> let's <laughs> pop a bottle but I don't know. I just but then the other side of it is like now that I'm older and you look back, it's like, oh, I was still young. You know, I was still like 16, 17. That do you think you're not now? I'm trying to like when I was 21, I felt like I was 23. You know, I felt like I was old. And when I like I, I you guys are I mean, I remember people calling me a kid 
when I was in my early 20s and it's like it was it felt like slang mm -hmm. but now you're I mean your kids it still feels that way do you feel like you're old no I don't I, I know that I'm still young but just being above 18 feels like a okay so I'm a full-blown in textbook like adult now you know I so felt like you can it look took back like at your childhood and be like I was like it felt like it kid. took a long time for both Charlotte and I to turn 18 yeah it did how long would you say it took <laughs> I would say about 18 years <laughs> what about you so around eight, the 18 same, sounds so same. yeah around the same do you have a boyfriend Get now around space um i don't know <laughs> <laughs> that's like that's the question isn't it uh I'm not sure about that so does that does that mean i move on or does that mean i get to ask follow-ups <laughs> you can ask whatever why aren't you sure of it you because you guys haven't had the like uh will you be my girlfriend will you be my boyfriend conversation <laughs> or do you just no. not remember because you're so stoned no because we um we we let me see kaya do you want to help me out here? yeah yeah. i was gonna say kaya we, seems to know something <laughs> kaya knows all of it why don't you do why don't you do an we, impression of charlotte explaining her boyfriend situation <laughs> also while we're at it i just want to make sure that this is going right okay the way you're sitting forward but it's gonna have to be what oh, this is how i was sitting the whole time Oh my God. Okay. All right. You could. Okay. I want you both to feel like you don't have to. You can move the mic to to fit you better. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm cozy. Okay. <laughs> All right. So you're gonna do. Yeah, Kaya can explain I, my boyfriend situation. Should I do like f as though I'm you explaining it? I don't really know what I can. I, I don't know. I think. I'll tell you what. Here's what we it. do. You go for it, <laughs> and I will send this for you know for you, whatever needs to be bleeped after. Um. I'm going to explain it as Charlotte's friend. So just you. So me. <laughs> well, yeah. But no, she's going to impersonate a real friend of mine. All right. Who's a friend of yours? <laughs> Not Kaya. Yeah. Who is it? Do you have other friends? I don't have any other friends. Kaya's okay. my friend. <laughs> I'm going to do it as me. Charlotte is a very loving and compassionate person and is very forgiving even when I personally think she should not be forgiving. But also as a friend, you got to be like... If he's your boyfriend today, he's your boyfriend today. And if he's not tomorrow, he's not tomorrow. And if he comes again the next day, then we're going to welcome him back. So um, I take it day by day with Charlotte. And um, sometimes she has sometimes a boyfriend. Sometimes we hate sometimes him. She sometimes doesn't. we love him. And when well, Charlotte doesn't like him, I don't like him. I'll tell you something. You're wrong about one thing. What? Charlotte has two friends. <laughs> this guy. This guy. <laughs> okay. It sounds like he's a, it sounds like he's a creep. No, he's a great, he's, um, he's a, I love him dearly. We love each other. He's a good, he's a great guy. He has a good heart. He just makes stupid decisions. You know, uh, a lot, you know who else has a good heart? <laughs> Jeffrey Dahmer. No, he was horrible. <laughs> oh my God. Terrible I was gonna example. I LeBron James. <laughs> yeah. Why don't you date LeBron? Why don't I date LeBron? That seems fitting. You're not telling me anything, girls. I think I told you he's a great guy. What I love what, what is my it? Dude. What do we not like? What do we not like? You know, what do we not like? Is we there, uh, is, I'll, 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 I'll lay down the, the possibilities. <laughs> infidelity. We don't like infidelity. We hate infidelity. Is he, uh, is, are you guys out on the town, right? And you're just like, you're just getting coffees and like you just saw the sister act, the musical. And then, then a girl walks by and I'm talking like 35, 55 <laughs> years old. Somewhere, <laughs> somewhere in between the two. Mm -hmm. And then he's like, he goes like this, damn. Wouldn't mind biting into that, but that's yeah. a, a different kind of infidelity. Different, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would prefer that kind. I'd prefer that blatant infidelity. Blatant is always to the face. Appreciated. So what are you saying? He's like when he's with his boys, he talks about other girls' butts, <laughs> or he's sleeping with other people. Do you know what, Rick? We're gonna cut this part out, okay? Because this, I'm not allowed to say this because it'll well, cause trauma for me. But I mean, not trauma, drama. But I'll say it to you. Fine.